This video brought to you by the Bose Headset 10. And by WX Weather. Hi, I'm Mary Grady from AvWeb, and I'm here today with Bernard Larferrier, who's the president of Explore Aero, and he's brought his new LSA, the EcoFlyer, to the show. Uh, Bernard, can you tell us what's unique about this aircraft? Okay, well, definitely the size of it. You know, it's a big airplane for this category. In Canada, it's uh, registered as an advanced ultralight, mm -hmm. and, uh, which is more restrictive than here. So we had a, quite a challenge to build a big airplane and, res and uh, still respect the LSA rule and the advanced ultralight rule to make sure that the empty weight was low to give some useful load on this plane. Uh, I think we succeed pretty well on it with uh, uh, six, 750 pounds empty weight for the airplane. So it still left 600 pounds of useful load with 30 gallons of fuel. So uh, it's, we're, we're very happy with it. This is a big airplane. Uh, we have 51 inches up at the shoulders. Give you a lot of room to for a lo those long cross-country flight. Up here on the uh, panel, we have an FS made by uh, Advanced Flight System, company out of Oregon. And uh, all the controls here, you know, throttle, choke, carbide, carbonate. Uh, adjustable uh, rotor pedal, because the seats are fixed, to make the CG in. And uh, we got the, a Y uh, control here for the aileron and the elevator. Now, there's a, there's a nice feature for this, because this airplane has been designed to fly, of course, but also to be used as a shelter when we are on the ground. So to improve the capacity of the airplane, we, are, we did design a backrest can flip and give more room in the back for the happy hour or for lunchtime. <laughs> and as I was saying, you know, when you turn the backrest, uh, it gives you plenty of space for a little table, and have lunch, and while your partner is sitting on the bed, uh, on the on the bed. Okay, we can see there's a lot of space in this airplane to go out and fly and have fun. Can you tell me a little about the construction and the engine and all of those kind of details? It's an uh, all composite airplane with few material, with few metal for the landing gear and the compression of the wings. But other than that, it's all composite. Uh, the way the, the, the airplane weighs 750 pounds, and I'll explain to you why later on. And uh, we have two different power plants, a Rotax with a wrap drive, which is very good on floats, and the Jabiru six cylinders with the Sensenich, which is very good on wheels. So those are two uh, power plants available. The airplane goes for $100,000, all equipped, uh, ready to go, 50000 for the kit. And we are uh, planning to start delivering in 12 months from now, by the end of next summer.